Well, hello. And it's Mama Jane's husband here, and it's... Mama Jane's... Oh, Mama Jane. Mama Jane. <laughs> Mama Jane's me. Yeah, it's her. It's yeah. just me. Um, and uh, we are um, uh, telling you about our first port in Norway, um, after leaving Iceland, uh, called Honesvang, um, which is quite a cool place. Uh, it's quite an amazing <laughs> uh, fjords all around yeah. it. And uh, we uh, got there um, and uh, we went on a shore excursion to the North Cape. Now the North Cape, for those of you who don't know, is the most northern this. point uh, in Europe uh, on the mainland. There are some islands further uh, above, uh, quite a lot further above, between this point and um, the North Pole, um, which also I think belong to Norway. Um, but this is the, the most northern point of mainland. And uh, uh, so we had a shore excursion there, didn't we? We did. Uh, and we passed some beautiful scenery on the way. Lovely scenery, just beautiful. Um, Lots of deer. You don't mean deer. No, I don't mean deer. Reindeer. Reindeer. Reindeer, yeah. Reindeer, yeah. Now they're just sort of wandering about or stopping the traffic or whatever. Yeah. And they're just uh, lovely, yeah. Lots of crazy birds. Yeah. Yeah. There were lots and lots of flocks of birds yeah. all over the place. <laughs> yeah. uh, lots of water, lots of sort of mini lakes. Yeah, so it's a very picturesque yeah. country. Picturesque. Certainly the, the more north you get, well, mm. I'm sure Norwegians would say it's all picturesque, but... Yeah. And the North Cape, well, they, they've got a visitor centre there um, so that you can go and uh, have a, a look at what's happened at the North Cape in the past. Um, and uh, but you are warned how windy it's going to be, and to actually walk around in pairs, not as singles. It was and so uh, windy. it was windy. Right? I mean, Mama neither Jane. Mama Jane's husband or Mama Jane are small, delicate people. No. But we had all on, even hanging on to each other like this. We were, we were, we were. On. <laughs> mm. <laughs> to not get blown over. It yeah. is so windy, so windy. Uh, but then you're at the top of the world you are and it's, of course it's going to be windy um not necessarily cold but just very very windy and there's an iconic globe made out of metal um which everybody tries to have their photo taken with and i did manage it um <laughs> with the sun there and everything and managing I unfortunately out. could not <laughs> make it across the open ground in well, the wind i'm already talking a few yards but i said no way i was hanging on to that fence for my life um, or for my broken bones, or not broken bones. But the scenery up there is really lovely. It and is. the visitor centre Fabulous. is quite good. Very um, good. And you walk in and then you take a, a small, it's a long slope that takes you down a number of floors, three floors in mm. fact, where there's a little cinema and you can watch a film about the North Cape. And uh, uh, you really, really Oh, it was lovely because it. obviously they've got to make this film that any language it, it's it you don't need words in it so it just showed you um all through the year from like I mean, the, the snow is <laughs> you cannot imagine snow like it unless you live here or there um and it showed you level, it? It, oh a different scale i mean where we live you know two inches of snow and the world stops um but here we're talking meters of snow and uh, people are still working they are still going out on fishing boats and then it took you all through the year all through the different seasons and it was just absolutely beautiful himself said mm, don't know about that but honest trust me on this i could take it or leave it but no, Mama Jane trust really me it, it was absolutely it just made you think goodness me what it must be like to live here mm. Now, top tip, the, it's worth going down to this film because when you, uh, you've, you've carried right on past the film and down the slope, it tells you all about the history of the North Cape as well. Yeah. There's a really nice chapel, oh, if yeah. that's what you're into, um, and uh, uh, went in there and yeah. it was... St John's went, Chapel, yeah. and it's... Um, it's it, an underground It's an underground church. Yeah, underground church. And it's, um, place. it's really meant for 
any national, any not nationality, any, any Christian spirituality, any spirituality, not even just Christian really, no. um, any spirituality, um, and it was a very moving place, only small, but lovely. Um, and then when you get to the bottom, there's another short film, isn't there, mm. about uh, the Northern Lights? Yeah. But top tip, there's a door, like, it's like a secret passage down the bottom that takes you out into this viewing area called the King's Landing. <laughs> and in this area, uh, it's quite sheltered and uh, you, you can view the sea uh, in, in relative safety there. Mm. And uh, I thought that was quite good. That was good. So we went back up from that, didn't yeah, we? Yeah. Um, went into a bit of shopping yeah. in the very nice gift shop. Yeah, it? very nice. Fact, and again, probably, very nice. Probably the best gift shop probably. we've seen. And a nice uh, restaurant, cafe mm. thing. Mm. The, the one thing I will say about all the places we've been to in Iceland and Norway, they have got this. Yes, of course, they want your money. They want you to be tourists and buy the key ring and the fridge magnet and whatever. And the t-shirt been there and done it and bought the t-shirt but they are good quality um they are there's no tat yeah. you know some places in england sadly it's tat and you're just wasting your money whereas i found here in all of them there's the, the good quality things mm. you know. um and uh, then we after that we And then we had a trip back, obviously, to uh, Alta, not Alta, Honisvag, <laughs> and uh, we had a little walk around Honisvag. Honisvag, mm. well, we went in a lovely little, we do spend a lot of time in coffee shops, yeah, we I like have to say. Coffee and cake. And <laughs> we, uh, we went and had coffee and cake in this very nice shop. Mm. They are not in Hoggensvag, Vag. they're not into tourists in a big way. I wouldn't say they're tourist friendly. No, um, everything in the shop was just written in Norwegian, which is absolutely fine. And in England, we don't write things in Norwegian, do we? No. But um, it is a place where uh, tourists come by cruise ship and by other methods. Um, they're not unfriendly. They're not unkind at all. They just are not making any particular effort to be tourist um Friendly. because the shop we went in the coffee shop she she'd got all this beautiful handmade stuff and lovely things but none of it was written in english the prices um well they're not always in english anyway but the, the actual there were no signs in english um so although she was a lovely lady um so i think mm. we found a pizza plate didn't we pizza plate. pizza plate we didn't go in there no we um, went in a pub then well, it was the it was a pub type cafe type place. Yeah, yeah. There is a pub, but that was pretty fullish. Yeah. There's a hotel. Um, there's quite a few hotels in fact. And there's a seaman's mission, seafarer's yeah. mission in the Baptist church. In the Baptist church, mm -hmm. and that looked a very helpful place to be if you were a sailor. Yeah. And then we did go to this cafe and have a drink, didn't we? It yeah. was beautiful. And the girls there who have. No, that was funny. Um, there was one was from the Philippines, mm. and the other I don't know where she was from. She was some Oriental um, looking person. Person, um, so I don't want to say she was Chinese because she may not have been. Um, and we asked for a particular beer, and she was really good, wasn't she? And she mm. said no because it's not cold yet. She's in the fridge, and uh, she so. Mama Jane's husband said, well, what have you got that is cold? And she was lovely, weren't she? she? Was. Very helpful. And what she recommended was very nice. Yeah. Yeah. So we sat outside and had a nice drink. 
Yeah. Uh, and it was right in the harbour. Yeah. And it was very quaint and very beautiful. Absolutely. It? We liked that bit quite a lot. We did like that bit. What we didn't like. Well, there was them. we we wandered back to the ship from there. Uh, Mama Jane did a detour looking for lipstick. <laughs> Um, and uh, while Mama Jean was uh, looking for lipstick, I found a few statues to, to photograph. I have no idea what they mean. Um, uh, and, then, and then we met up, Mama Jean and me, and uh, I found another statue to photograph. And then the heavens opened. <gasps> Imagine somebody turning the taps on. They were I... like a shower outside. It was like... With hailstones. It was. <laughs> we got wet. Through to my. Can I say knickers? Because I did get wet through to my knickers. My my nice <laughs> phone, my 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 Canon phone. You don't mean your phone. I I, I mean what your camera. 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 My camera. Canon camera has died. Has died. Mm. It got so wet in this storm that it's not <laughs> it's not turning it's on. Not well, I think it's shorted out, which is a bit of a disaster, really. Yeah. So. Um, we had a, a mad dash back to the <laughs> the ship, which of course, then there was queues because everybody was trying to get on. So we got <laughs> even more wet queuing to get on the ship. <laughs> so it was um, an adventure. It was an adventure. An adventure. Yeah. yeah. And then last night, um, as we sailed away, our sailing away from uh, Hollisvad was delayed because of this bad weather. Uh, so it was quite late when we sailed by the North Cape, which we'd been to earlier in the day, but now we could see from the sea. And uh, uh, it was a dark and um, forbidding place, I thought. Brooding. Brooding. And um, all the islands that were before it were, looked the same, didn't they? Yeah. But on the North Cape, there were a light on in the visitor centre and uh, it was the light in the darkness. Do you think somebody there. had left that on by mistake? No, I think it was there deliberately. Yeah, yeah, so nobody went into the North Gate. <laughs> how, how you could run into the <laughs> North Gate, I don't know. It's a no, big thing. It's a big a thousand thing. foot sheer, sheer drop. Yeah. Um, and then uh, that was it, weren't it? Mm. It was bedtime. Mm. After all that, yeah. Oh, we went to cinema. Oh, we went to the cinema. Cinema. cinema this or... this ship. Uh, not all ships have cinemas, but this one does. And um, we went to see um, Downton, Downton Abbey. <laughs> this Downton Two, weren't it? Yes. Yeah. Good film, by the way. Yeah. yeah good film. In a yeah. Downton Abbey sort of way. Yeah. And now we are. Um, so that's two of the Norway ports done. Yeah. Um, and uh, we'll have to catch up with the Iceland ports. Yeah. If we get a moment. But it's time for some food now. So it's a goodbye from me. And it's a goodbye from him. Goodbye. Bye.